for Nairobi dating stories Mr. Rogato wewe mwenye umekuwa on the same stage na Goofy before you know mm-hmm. hey you know <laughs> light work light work unaweza <laughs> <laughs> light work <laughs> that's light unaweza <laughs> unaweza tuambie vile vile we feel cool to the show and most of the people tulikuwa nayo huko kwa mekana wewe huu ndio aliamua you know akuji kusupport mm? i'm on support for so long <laughs> akamwacha kaemta <laughs> life got in the way guys life got in the way mli experience aje nairobi dating stories which will going to happen on the 24th and 25th of june 2023 this past weekend at the time of this recording at braeburn theater goofy has done a show there before alifanya home in 2017 i believe that was in may and mufasa amefanya pia a show huko before alifanya mufasa for president huko last year in may I think that was 28th. Mm. in preceding this moment last year Goofy alikuwa na the other things in love October 19th I believe and then May 1st alifanya Black Boy Joy Abe alikuwa featured and if you know Abe and unaweza na skin color yake you know why alikuwa featured kwa Black Boy Joy <laughs> And it's ever right color because I'm a, I'm a very joyous individual <laughs> my job there's a kuhusu Nairobi uh, dating stories uh it i kwa it was everything i expected it to be meaning uh meaning uh like i can uh, like the poetry i know what i was going to get but the thing like were interested sana ni kuona how they would use um mike na esther and for me i was like well they they made the show for me uh what on like the timing in human in your your concept ya therapy au kwa therapist alafu like walita in your story brilliantly that is mike mushiri na esther kazo uh, so like and appear plus yo ku let a goofy na mufasa introducing them therapy alafsa au kusema hizo stories from like you know like at first i kwanza na ilikuwa conversations kwanza na wanaongelea about the experiences with certain dates and what not alafu i think is odds y'all gonna feel is big enough wanna wanna turn into a, a whole performance so i liked how they tied into it um alafu ya kwangu wao walikuwa like ni walikuwa standard and then um the guy on the sax alikuwa don Yeah. the last thing i found on that stage <laughs> i love it uh, even the, before that yeah yeah but sir can you lead home that last piece of mufasa eh nili nili i shed a tear yo yeah. i love sir the lady coming in kuimba alafu na mazana sax you look that's how you end the show like if the rest of the show ingekuwa ilikuwa terrible if that was it na mufasa si afanye kitu kingine ama goofy niko like I'm okay like that's just <laughs> that's how you end it. Yeah. Uh yeah so it it likwa in terms of the poetry um nothing stood out as much but Mufas last piece it likwa like why cuz I think I could relate to it. Um the the skits it likwa well done the interludes na yo ma performances zilikuwa rasa alifanya fit na hiyo Nairobi um, alafu kulikuwa na Shiro with the nini so alafu the, we didn't see the MC which was until the end so nilipenda how they brought that together um all in all alafu yeah the stage and how ilikuwa <laughs> hey, kwa levels man wali waleta garim zima bana kwa stage <laughs> <laughs> yeah. investment hey, yo yes yeah, set design new stage ilikuwa very well designed i think of all the shows ni attend in terms of stage design the poetry nothing beats that yeah. I've, i've not seen anything better than that like kwa your stage design alafu i think the place it's the, the way your braban theater in a very intimate i don't think this would inge work as well at at uh, tnt TNT, TNT. Because I feel, uh, because of the way the stage uh, is so like for that that's the perfect nini alafu alikuwa na swing alafu alikuwa na coordinate the outfits na the the background so everything it was executed well alafu the fact that they they do two shows consecutively i just space out 
na the second date ilikuwa almost sold out the first date was alikuwa na kusa seats so we can take that away from them you and me uh, but i also understand why they are going that route because i think goofy and mufasa are a point in here like it can't just be poetry any yeah. uh, all the time like cuz yeah the, the, i think been there done yeah, that yeah like they, they don't have to so just explore and of all the i didn't the sequence the sequence of mufasa for president but uh nimenda for all of goofy's nini i think this in terms of execution it was the best of all these shows in my in in terms of like execution you know what it's about like when i get immediately just you don't even think about wait what's going on black boy joy kuna you thought yeah wait kuna some sad pieces of kuna like kuna different featured acts when i come na their own story so kuna yo contrast i love who is in guinea goofy and the midnight kids i didn't quite get it no na uh, but then when i get so but he nairobi dating stories it was just that you just tell the stories the therapy nini kila kitu ilikuwa in a time together so i think this is their best well in terms for goofy this is his best but it's in show yao like this is their best nini mwana from both of them i think black boy joy was the most conceptually layered mm. you you have to sit and think how are these pieces tying to mm. the concept of black boy joy how is this segment ya ebe connecting to the show performance ya slim kufikira hizi moving pieces zingine achieng pale nyuma all the performances kina edi rasamor you had to ponder and kwangali mm. okay how are they tying to the concept i think this one was very direct yeah. and straightforward and it was easy to digest you know now with therapy pale unasikia the story and then it's storytelling nikatu as i was telling you tukiongelea the other things and love the other time but the conversation yeah the level of poetry yeah. and the level of writing and then the level of storytelling and the level of writing yo show yake na stella kivuti very direct yeah. the storytelling very direct well, so the relationships and then kulikuwa na hizo moments za poetry i think this one had more poetry yeah. than the other things but, but and no, love mufasa does well is as much as it's direct unaza feel kuna element in yoga okay cuz kulikuwa na piece kulikuwa na times mufasa na toka stage wasio like oh like una check like because yeah, i think his second last piece <laughs> yeah. Yeah, i'll get into the zone yeah, get into the zone but akoko his poetic yeah, bag and poetry and, and bad still it's not too difficult to digest that come away seems a poetry so i think kuna there's a way he does it that it's very easy on the air like oh na get can say malafu in a hit anajua anajua ku hit so he does that brilliant yada kwa hizo poetic tunes this you fanya like ara come open the poetry like oh this is such a nice story iko mm-hmm. ni kitu very engaging so uh, and and I, i wouldn't i don't think we're going to see vain speculative <laughs> uh, like uh, another like he- poetry heavy like concept show from from the two anymore i think we will it's just purely poet like I, for the poetry audience ukisema okay, so purely poetry nafikiria mimi nafikiria show kama a black boy joy mm. that we can i, we, I can see Goofy doing that again where cuz hapo kuko na hizo moments of storytelling yeah as alifanya kwa the other things in love where ni a story kuna narrations kuna hiyo skit yake na Morris katikati ya the show hizo kuongeza hizo elements where alifanya kwa Black Boy Joy I can see him doing such a show again we'll see but I'd love, I'd love to see you ni cuz he, he I think it worked it worked for them mosoti mm. so everything in eba mesema is true uh but <laughs> so uh, after show uh, after your hype you uh, know the show was amazing uh, me i loved it uh, worth every single coin in any lipio show i'd watch it again the only thing you notice afterwards is for the second half you feel like a script iliandikwa for the first half i love for the second half i go you can realize how you utilize kina esta kazungu for the second half nika the first half ndio alikuwa ameandika mm. vizuri alafu the second half ilikuwa more performance heavy bila now that so i don't know i, I was just curious about uh, what exactly do nilikuwa nakaa naangalia niko like okay sawa so, uh, 
this feels like a totally not not a totally different show but in a feel ni kama kulikuwa na two different writers when you're andika hizi nini hizi segments jo the first part ilikuwa na Esther Kazungu ilikuwa na that therapy and all that that was like the theme of the first and after the second part uh ilikuwa to just them performing with the musical interludes and that's it yeah so me for me that's what it felt it did not take away from the gig but it just felt like two different things that was my that's just what i thought but generally i i loved it uh comes ani nikitakanga show na skenga nika nafaka kwenda tu niandike hiyo mimi so fire and a feeling and a feeling no and a so yeah bado jeisha so this week nda create kitu mzuri from just that fire and um yeah i really so far most of the shows ni menda za kina goofy kina mufasa i've always been impressed and Kwanza, I was actually in Nico very skeptical to the same when you mention about Nairobi dating stories Nico like if someone else angefanya this show tungepata just another tungepata exactly what the show was about ni people when in Nairobi dating na venye wa me heartbreak hiyo na hizo vitu zote but the way we got it from Kina Goofy and Mufasa it was exactly that but so different from how someone else and they approach ebu yeah. elaborate for someone yeah, because i completely get your point you to get feel only goofy and mufasa wangeongeza the layers that they did exactly. for such a title for a concept but when i expound quote wengine ingekuwa tu women bad man oppressed it is the the, the only thing wangekuwa nafanya that feels different in their paces ingekuwa nikawa najaribu ku flip your script at oh men have been hurt by women pia sisi angalia sisi pia sisi tumepitia kama wanaume pia by women that's what they would have done but how and get deeply into how it happens the feelings and so how and ifanya exactly how goofy na mufasa wameifanya i think michael alikuwa the the key yeah to that entire show ni interesting that you mention the second half of the show because as nilikuwa nielekea mtaa jana tukiwa tao yeah. kuna mtu ali mention how waliongeza cuz Mike na Esther mm-hmm. the other segment kwa the second half where now Mike Miriam <laughs> I got tell story yake uh. akiambia Nancy mwenye eh, ni Esther akimwambia pia amevunjwa moyo which ilikuwa this sarcastic and fun interpolation of story uh, <laughs> there were jesuses right so kabi wa jesus <laughs> they went at them they went at them very humorous that hiyo part waliongeza yeah haikuwa on saturday which na kuanga fascinating ukienda hizi shows zile kwa ngana a couple of days oh for real the, uh, so there are bada, things to para mm. relax <laughs> eh there are things that was a new one for instance yeah. pia i even mentioned kwa my live jana kama ungeenda to ali for birds last year the opening night friday then we share sato uli share sato sindio yeah. and also ali share sato had a better experience than friday what can be i say the show ni better ishia ni mchekizi stories ni amazing and then miss and lisha sunday and friday you could not pair the differences in vile wana perform and some beats zile wametoa some that wameongeza how the performers are moving kwa stage and how they are doing it kuna hizo differences then pia how the audience is responding to what is being done because i mentioned slim alikuwa ananiambia ile party ya Whitney Houston ya Mufasa yeah. akiimba on saturday mm. wakiifanya Mufasa alimba hivi the first line mm. the crowd ka take over oh. and wakaimba the rest of it unajua ilikuwa different jana Mufasa ali have ku ku perform line after line after line and then kuna pota kauliza eh kuna kuna fans of Mufasa na hapa not you ni mkapo entertainers watu wakaanza watu wakaanza ku pick or also ile party le gufia nasema ask me what the shoes mean ask me why the heart alisema slim told me on saturday people got into it easier than vile 
alifanya jana hiyo ku have kunajua se wamuulize and then tukapata an extra performance from the therapist so hizo ni vitu zile waliongeza and pia the audience response and reaction ilikuwa different so hizo vitu kwa interesting ku ku note na correspond we just mentioned Nairobi and how ulipenda hiyo piece ya Goofy and how alitai the city <laughs> and how people talk about relationships in Nairobi and how we tie the city and how it affects us and how we view relationships and how we love and how we are the city and how we love and i think that's what we're going to say that yeah. only goofy and mufasa could pull such yes jukilikuwa the classic nini ya uh, uneka breadcrumbs alafu zinakuja kumata at the end of the nini like ni kama ilikuwa ni kani movie mtoto upitisha alafu unaona casting kadamu but camera imepita but hiyo damu inamaanisha kitu na itakuja movie as in it's just the rating was just good i was i was okay i've always been impressed by goofy but i was even more impressed ju uh, i know nilikuwa nilikuwa na mshow after the show at the uh, man when i grew up nataka kwa wewe akanambia wewe acho fala ni kama show ju na grow na jaribu kwa kwa wewe alafu by the time na grow usha grow father so but the, the second half kwangu ilikuwa ili feel a little long but me i actually did enjoy the second uh, half ju ilikuwa na more, more performances more performances na hakukuwa na ju okay not to take away from what kina esther alikuwa anafanya take away from it <laughs> <laughs> no, i'm just saying uh, personally i've never been i'm not the biggest comedy fan yeah i have never been the biggest comedy <laughs> fan <laughs> so cheka i'm going to check and all yeah. and i did love the show usi fan of it to mainstream and i did love and uh, nikisema nilipenda what they did i did love and nilicheka but for me i'm more geared towards uh, something more serious when it comes to art na vitu kaizo na not serious as in serious 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 as in uh what do you want to understand different kind of emotion serious kind of emotion see <laughs> it's very hard to explain <laughs> No 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 pisil go hit. No so be ukupenda the comedy ya shit. No 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 I did nilipenda. Like the issue it's not that I hate comedy. It's not that I hate comedy. I do not hate comedy by any chance ni vile tu. I'm not the biggest fan of it. Eh. When I So it's still good. Nilipa nilipenda the first part. Like ilikuwa ili ilikuwa na feel like oh this is actually something I can follow. The second part like when I feel like Goofy comes on stage alafu interlude ya music alafu Mufasa comes on stage alafu so ile kwa na feel ni kama tumeluzio ile kwa imeenda poa ni ile kwa imeanza poa tunajoa wako therapy session yeah. tumeko introduce to this therapist moja ana ako in review ni nini alafu tunona Goofy ana come as the first nini yeah. ina make more in, 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 in make more sense Uh, it doesn't feel like oh mufasa ama alza performance i feel like oh gufi ama alza session yake mufasa ama kamsa session yake so wange wange find a way ku prolong so that ikwe isikwe ni kama hiyo second part ilikwenda ka gufi music mufasa music okay. comedy piece nini although in hindsight nikiangalia i feel nikawa alikuwa na maybe alikuwa differentiate you can realize even the more uh, hearty pieces is it like one the first sec- section so probably that might be the reason one and the do me i'm you the whole issue about serious pieces the second half do you like na kan askiza na feel like hakuna points between the performances penye what i'm feeling sort of in a change drastically nila to talk from something very serious to something very comedic mm. to something very serious again how can i feel like kama tuna switch hivo So it like one sort of an emotion in you carried through to Kamanzo had him it felt like a complete journey bila nini that is the nini so i think even hiyo kutumia kina kazungu might that might be might have been the reason mbona waliotumia less in the second half ju imagine after mufasa speech mtu akuje doesn't make sense yeah. and even so, uki uta realize that hiyo session ya medium kutuambia story yake ilikuja mbele mbele yeah. before waendele na they are pieces and kuskia more music don on sax ashley on yeah. vocals tony on keys rasamor on keyboard half live na bass and then mathai on lead 
na walifanya Mutoria pia aliperform actually kwa hiyo set ya pili alifanya na flex ba nakumbuka watu walikuwa stage performance kwa mimi ni by name the sacks majua production manager was si ule stage manager was the guy sat on my left alikuwa kamera crew and pia watu wali share 24 birds mike ali also a stand out kwa 24 birds mike ni brilliant man yeah, like oh, I, I, all of the little point ali mba man man oh eh ni watu ni flex kitu kitu na feel wange fanya like ninge pada yafanyike na yote time wenye after wako na hiyo session hapo like stage left ama mm. wherever mm. penye alikuwa like instead of kusema acha nisimame nisemee hey, angeanza tu hapo hiyo piece alafu asimame watu wangi follow tu mimi pia nilifikiria hivyo hiyo uh, hiyo ya kuna sort of hesitation uh, yeah. and then you just start talking uh, and then you stand but, as you go to a uh, center stage inge, ala, ala, yeah. ala, 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 yeah. I, I, I don't i don't think there's no need for you nini no for the nini uh, cuz wale kwa nasikia yeah, already nini yeah. so unasimama yeah, tu yeah, alafu una dim lights like inge flow to seamlessly cuz the wonder alikuwa anasema e I also felt the same with with Mathai and Rasamore kuongea before their performances. Ex- ah, and, yeah. and 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 ADP alifanya during Black Boy Joy and I think we had other things in love kusema what's up guys I am I am Eddie give it up for Gucci. Kila mse Mutoria nini inatoa sana inakutoanga because ah yeah because kisha tusha join nani of course I'm not sure you have I'm not sure you have perform let's keep it going also okay siku maybe I'll introduce but I could introduce why you like oh yeah Oh yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, yes. <laughs> like, oh, nani. Na alifanya Nairobi, alimbe yo the Nairobi ni fit. So angi, angi come to immediately to Ivo. Ah. The base and then Mathai the subtle mm. the intricate. Uh, it takes away uh, so I think sijui kama ungefanya pia for Shiroka bengeweza. Cuz yeah, Uba alikuja katikati ku introduce yeah, yeah. Shiroka fanya comedy. I think ada Uba Uba ange come ange, katikati. Like, Shiroka yeah, ingia tu hapo. Hata hata towards the end. Then mu- Ali ruinio moment for me. Yo. Yo moment ya. Yo. Yo piece ya Mufasa. Mhm. Alafu oh, ya alikuja kabla dona mali. Hey. So hapo ilikuwa like no no acha. Eno jo nilikuwa nilikuwa naifikiria nikijiambia ime happen twice kwa show za Goofy. Oile. For me. Ya yeah, ching. Black Boy Joy yeah. tulikuwa na wewe. Tulikuwa na wewe. <laughs> after peace ya aching after that song na vile alinini kwa silikuwa kwako mm aching if you listening to mm. this ni ajeni aje me mm. <laughs> and this song about women supporting each other yeah. through sexual assault yeah <sighs> and that building of sisterhood and caring for one another and what that song talks about and ile place ametupeleka ah The rest of goofy. <laughs> ah yeah yeah. <laughs> Try came in I felt horrible in Zambia. Yeah. Why? Like, Why? Uh, more shows without MCs. Are you making light? No cuz uh, after your Mufasa moment. Mhm. Only close to the curtains alafu lights come on alafu nyim na get the hint. Say same pia na your piece your piece ya Mufasa. Kuna yeah. sema hivi tukiwa na wewe na Slim. Na Slim. If you know the context of that piece ya Mufasa ya Mwisho. Yeah. And you know where it's coming from and what it's about. To you it's beyond listening to a piece and imagining yeah. of someone kwa mind yako. So kwa leo audience na hawajui you might still feel the emotions for sure cause ali deliver. You might still feel the emotions. Ni kama ile piece ya Goofy on Black Boy Joy kuhusu Kifo. No yeah. yeah. budake and yeah. people up until Nyacharo. Yeah. Yo. Yo. Yeah. So something similar. If you know the context and the way people may perform, you can, oh, without the context you can still feel but you have the context. Yeah, it hits and Luski Villa may hits. perform. And then Ash takes it to a whole another level. And then Don on sax. Kwa kio tu pale kando kwanza and then Mufasa kam bring katikati wakaishia wakamwacha. Ma yo yo kwanza yo ile kwa like the way alifanya hiyo ni perfect 
that was perfect you just walk out and as you say mm. in terms of the directions wakiumse wakati so wambi akimaliza Visually, mm. anza kutoka tenzi lienda juu, yeah. kuzo lienda mbele ya curtains, yeah. goofy on our right, kibeto na our left. Then wakazi leave, tuka pata Nancy, who is Esther, na Miriam, who is Mike, pale kwa therapy, akim orient into this job, anaanza. So ikiisha pia, after Donna amefanya kitu yake, waishushe tui vichini. Because Pia Tony on because the, the keys oh, Pia's in the yes. yeah. feeling that you I'm not sure guy like over the sky while while on the same experience on Saturday. No, no okay. Mm. Now this is secret okay so you niambi wana mse uh on Saturday it was not all that. Really? Compared to nene kuna so many things like generally on Saturday was slightly ju nakumbuka I have a friend when you're complain at the, the humor it was more learning of not the jokes the delivery of the jokes haikuwa on point so alikuwa na feel nika the humor in a rely on uh, the tribal uh, nini your accent you know so wow ali talk and that give away like uh, the performances were nice but the humor connecting those performances is because in a rely on that but mimi so jole ni show before ni come show so kuja show that's what i expected but that's not what i got and get like points when you the humor was actually really mm. good humor despite despite the nini accent being the way it was delivered through so you know i did not attend saturday so i cannot say fika that that is what happened but yeah miki to nilisikia kutu sato ilikuwa walikuwa na some jitters kwa hiyo show ya kwanza oh oh na motori haku haku perform akua i also didn't see why alpha perform ingine gani motori juni motori <laughs> no <laughs> don't like didn't you hear <laughs> Cause, cause, but but not ange perform kama ange, kama ange perform to like bila ko come on stage alafu ku tune guitar po nini nini ange come to alafu anza to kuimba ama to to skate to from somewhere alafu a walk in nini i think ange kwani cuz you know some moments are the pause pause alafu no inge kwa better but yeah. sausage was still good with him in it yeah yeah, yeah. i feel like what yeah. was saturday we miss out on how could show like kinde i said lipa lipa relax lipa na yo 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 your story a transition kibet ali execute perfectly on mufasa for president the transitions seamless ili kwa oh and yeah na kumbuka we only saw them yes. in mwanzo na mwisho nilikuwa najiambia yes this and of, of course goofy aliona my review aka 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 incorporate kwa the other things in love na pia alisikia maoni yangu kuhusu black joy anajipatch kwa mgongo okay of course goofy of <laughs> course goofy anaongea na 600 people lakini ni moyo moyo tu ndo pengine na 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 kuongea na yeye alisikia review alisikia review I'll take time. I'll take time. <laughs> no review. Kuniaka kwa screen yake kubwa kwa nyumba. <laughs> Akani watch. <laughs> And as 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 Eb umesema. <sighs> Uba pia kakuja. <sighs> Uba manje ka unasikiza man. Kwanza lingia dola ki perform. Eh yo yo ni alafu the thing he actually ni distract cuz when i walk in i will talk ko yo nini unezona nili like yeah. eh, attention yangu inaenda ikaenda kwake ikaenda kwake ikatoa from you nini so yo yeah, and pia eh vitu tie na ching angea cha tio moment seat na pia eh, na pia ki stage directions vile walizipanga as slim alikuwa anasema hata angekuwa huko juu angekuwa chini and sasa ingekuwa after curtains imeshuka a minute or so and then we lift curtains then we big up what because uh, yo yeah. eh hata eh yo cut waki lift curtains kila msa on stage so yeah, we do thank you na that's all you need that that's all you need <laughs> yo eh mufasa yo pc yo mwisho because initially you gonna fikiria they'll bring the therapist mwisho yeah. and then you can come a cliff hanger whereby wana to pair maybe a story Mm-hmm. of other sessions that they had but didn't happen on stage oh, una yeah. get kuhusu goofy na mufasa ku progress the story and then inatwacha hivyo the problems are not solved the stories are Nairobi <laughs> zinaendelea zina continue but maybe you understand but, part 2 <laughs> yeah, but, yeah, but towards the end let we really share with 
an emotional because your your pc agufi pia ya roses yes. are red yes. and see how this goes but love watch and red <laughs> and how i build i build and you've been here before 10 9 yo i love the countdown ilienda ni kama the story lianza hapa love on account all the way love on rudi akarudi eh akarudi nyuma hiyo cycle hiyo cycle hiyo cycle and then mufasa just I'm a happy boy mufasa <laughs> akipeleka kwingine he brought a black boy ili manje ili make sense vile iliisha yeah. made sense vile vile iliisha hiyo emotional anyway but one word like uh, yo i mean i make history i don't think yeah. Yeah, that's oh, it. Oh, that, that's, that's oh, it. Is. you can take that away from them like one of the summer we're not doing poetry anymore right mm. and yeah and so <laughs> in a decade plus of putting in the work ndio afike hii point ya putting a show for two days na watu wakuje na ano wasi wana fax za kwa royalties from nini stuff kama is they've done it they've the evidence is there mufasa goofy mean he success mnapata mna pull different audience members different crowds Nah. Oh, also in the realize like half the most of the audience huko haikuwa the kukikata audience ya poetry ya tunapatana huko kwa sato oh mimi naongea joe yeah lembo hivyo kwa sato ilikuwa more yeah. na spoken word uh, oh. fans uh, than yeah. yesterday sato definitely no, sato ingekuwa regardless kuona like unjoe ndo kitoja realize like sato kulikuwa kumeja how i love sunday kulikuwa na bado watu yeah. besides yeah. how Almost na wameja <laughs> but and yeah, like, you know mufasa na gusa wanaza sema tuko na show two weeks from now na wanaza 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 